na papa bi edi nkomo e wo na fide ya mi wan Nigeria ni nkomo a odi ene se hwan kwa ne tu obi fusu wo nkosku na mi se ei o se hwan ne tu fo se fo obi nkosku because obi tu wo kusuku a na so cheke eye years na eni pa ne mfa no kosku na papa in teje mu no na so ye calculation na se o wo 3 years ni ade ade akora ne ntena fie a to be abe 4 years na 5 years na o maame no ntena fie ntwa akoda na o ma ne fie nyansa dan so odi ne be kwode ke ni ade ade so be sai sika na wo kwa ye wadwuma enya ade abe bo abusua no sai sika no betimi de ahwa akoda no e ko pom se obedu time wo timi su ade e wo su fie nyansa awie no na akoto aso e wo suku dem since same say no dabetu a trendy wo media no so amafo me be na abusa question say ah papa in say mo a work kan eh o person wo kire say me nim wa dwen kire wa wo hwe me eya ampa me do your work be kan no hu ni say eh writer na who told you that you must go to school where did you get the idea from who ingrained that thinking into you a child is not supposed to go to school until the child is 4 years old because we destroyed the public education a generation of private school owners came and started coming up with products to take money from our pocket and program us into the bondage of education. Mm -hmm. So they start talking of uh, preschool, kindergarten, uh, all kinds of names for the first four years where nothing. And many people now, that's what you are spending money on. So your husband is earning 250. You are earning 80,000 or 100,000. So the total money coming to your family is 350. The school fees you are paying is 200. Where is the wisdom? Can't somebody stay at home and say, look, you know what? For the first four years of my child's life, Even I'm going five. to stay. I'm going to homeschool this child. My husband, you'll be working. I will stay at home. Many women that are working today, they are not supposed to be working. It has nothing to do with family. It's about my family. What's her family value? This is the formative stage of this student. Stay at home because what you are going to earn mm. is not even anything. You are going to earn 100. So if you are earning something big, they will say, okay, only maybe you, are, the man will be the one to stay at home. Because we see this happening all over. So we should diffuse ourselves. Please say that again, sir. Because the, your voice was very loud when you were saying the women can no, stay at home. No, no, no. If, if the, the woman, woman is, is any more, mm -hmm. the man should stay at home. Uh -huh. It's happening everywhere. Take care of this it's for your family. The man will now stay at home. You homeschool these people. Mm -hmm. Because one of the things that has affected us is because we have this mindset of full-time housewife. Full There's nothing like that anymore in the 21st century. What because everybody, full-time full housewife. housewife. Because everybody can work from home now. Mm. So from home, you can be a millionaire, a billionaire from your home. There are many things you can do from home. So there is nothing like, hey, I don't want to be a full-time housewife. You can be a stay-at-home mom and run things from home and take care of the formative stage of your children. When is now time for them to go to school? The most important education is primary and secondary. Case closed. Anything after secondary school, you are fooling yourself. Majority of the university today, they are all just wasting their life away. Because yeah. many of the oh, courses oh. you are studying is useless. The world is changing. Yeah. The day you many enter school, by the time you graduate in five years' time, everything you have learned is useless. Over 80% of what you learn in university is useless in the real world. So what are we killing ourselves? University, you don't know any trade, you don't have anything. After you finish 22 years in school, the first letter you write is I beg to apply. So the educational system was programmed to make you a beggar so that you can be begging for job because we have people graduating, they can't create job, they are seeking for job. Once you have finished primary school and you have discovered purpose, from primary school, you can also say, okay, I'm going to catering school three years or two years. I'm going to uh, tailoring school two years. I'm going, you will now go and study to yes. develop the skill that you have discovered. And you can become a chef from at, that point at 13 because yes because the, the courses of the future most of the courses people are studying now they are trying to solve yes at this problem the courses that will solve tomorrow's problem does not require four years why because certification is almost every six months new new things are coming up so you need between six months to 18 two years max to be focused on the basics of any skill or career and then you continue to grow in that career what about computer programming if that's the simplest one in six Online. weeks you can start making money in six weeks you don't need to go to spend master, four years um uh, cyber security well, all manner of stuff going on you can sit in your house and you'll be making millions so, ma in dollars legally there are schools in this lagos that will teach you that free of charge they will house you, you they will feed you they will teach you free they will still give you a job and then you will pay back when you get a job over a period of time school will free in this lagos people are not looking for that they want to go and do four years and then four years that will become six years because it's the programming 
because when we're growing up, our parents wanted to be a doctor, lawyer, engineer. All those courses are useless now. Dr. 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 AI is taking what over. What I'm hearing you is, eh? we should. Law. Law is we should. Think. There is nothing called law, but yes, my aunt, uh, any, <laughs> they are all expired courses. Law, so, medicine, it's about AI thinking. is doing it. That what thing will take over? The law you are studying, you are studying law in Nigeria. When you get to England, you can't practice. You have to acclimatize to their own. You do their bar. You go to America and say, but the software now, AI, will be a global lawyer that has every law of every nation and understands every language. So which law are you reading? We're just wasting time. It's a programming that we have not yet understood. And we are still following that so, you know, know, assembly I'll line. So I'll argue, argue with all yes. this medicine. I won't leave law. Medicine. And you, any, you actually need to go and study medicine. And see any, there are AI now, there are robots now. We're in the fourth, in fact, we're in the fifth industrial revolution, and any, that it, I will put the machine on your body now. It will tell me everything about you from A to Z, from A to 2, the state of your kidney, your liver, your lung, and okay. the treatment you need to have. Do you know there are tablets you can take now, just one vitamin? Everything you need for your old days inside. Well, you sir, don't need to eat. Sir, I agree with most of the things. You'll be okay. So I'm not saying that those things will not be needed, but the number of people okay. that are going in there will be left stranded. Because by the time you come out, we need 50. There are 5 million of you. You will not be stranded. So we need to begin to think of... Think differently. Yeah, That's it. Because that. the way forward is you must be a value creator. Many people are in the marketplace. They are not offering value. They are just going to collect. And what does it mean? Money flows in exchange for value. What is value? Meeting needs, solving problems, and answering questions. So you must have something you are offering your generation that they are paying you for. People don't employ for activity anymore. They employ for productivity. Uh, you know, you are an entrepreneur. Do you know how many unemployable graduates we have in Nigeria? They can't speak good English. They can't write letters without correction. They didn't go to school. No, and these are the people. And you are talking to they, they, do. they went to school. They went to school, but no, school didn't saying... go through there because most of these schools, they are not teaching them anything. Okay. They are just buying hand out. I agree with you. Do you have an idea of the Nigerian University? 300 people in the class, 120 people in the class, 80 people in the class. Lecturers don't come. They don't even come. These are the realities. Why are we deceiving ourselves? You now say my child is in this, is in that, then we now say it's a private university. This is a private this. This is a Christian no, 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 school. No, 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 but I feel that there's such a generalization, some people will be confused and think that university education is a no-no. I'm trying to understand that you mean the state of our tertiary education right now. Because of the way it is, we need to look for other alternatives to educate ourselves. Okay. That's what you're saying. Now, what I'm saying is this. Because, let me just add this, yeah. because this AI you're talking about, those people that have created this, they went to university. Now, so listen, please listen. I have two master's degree, I have two PhD, not all... I went to school, so I have two PhD. So I'm not saying that you should not go to school. I'm not saying that you don't need education. But when you are going to school, be going to school because you really need it. Be going to school because it is important to help you to become who you are supposed to be. Many people already discover what they are supposed to do. I'm supposed to be a fashion designer, but because of this programming, you want to first go and do medicine. Yes, then you now come back to that. You want to first do architecture first. That is the deception I'm talking about. Don't, and then when you are going to school, don't go to school based on the programming of the courses you think will help you to be marketable. Go to school to study the courses that will help you to solve the problem of the world you are living in. Many of us are mirroring our parents' dreams and desires. That's why the popular courses are now. If you, if someone, if, do you know that in our own days, if you have told your mom you want to be an actor, an actress, they will have said you are a prostitute, they will have said you are doing this, you want to be a sport, footballer, they will say, hey, God, oh, who did this to me? But now we are in the same case now. If a child comes to you now and says, Mommy, I want to be a drone pilot, will you agree? If your child comes to you today now and says, I want to go into robotics, will you agree? I want to be a graphic artist, will you agree? Because in your consciousness, mm. being a graphic artist is not a career. It's a, a graphic artist, they draw picture. That is the program that we have all been programmed in. The colonial masters messed us up and we are messing up the next generation. Mm. Because we, if, no, think of it. Every time you ask a child, what do you want to become? Majority of them tell you they want to become something that requires them to go and get a job from somebody to get a salary. That's the programming I'm talking about. We have been programmed to go to school. The education sector, as it is today, was not set up to help you. It was set up to create workers for the marketplace of, for capitalists. So it's for us to now know that, look, I'm not going to be a pawn in that. I'm going to go to school to learn to earn. 
to learn to mm. develop my skill mm. so that I can be skillful to be able to offer value so that money will flow. Me patcho do okay. You who say a writer, but you do comment aba. According to one, na che say e wasa akoda ni tine fi na papa no koye juma na sika na ma me no so oko pa aba no. O do ni tine fi no che akoda no na akoda ni nyen fi nyansa ansa no akwa ku resu ku mu minim wadwen che obetim lo de aba because e trendy and comfort for bebe na ebu sha say papa na kasa ye bi se wan kasa ye ma fo bebe obi a che na adwene e de fa ho a enye asem ketu wo se mo ban ban hu hia na me papa mu die pro technologies ana me kan for ma wo ane pro technologies we are specialized in both sales and installation of cctv cameras yet on esa install cctv cameras in the sour gun and nasa brochure now if you are gun now pursue a cctv camera installation we need pro technologies and in sour so we get cctv camera installation and now you interior decoration so as if you're in a way and now you're still feeling a mountain you sign decoration you best yes you'll be an hour officer at the amount and ready to pay at the amount our gana uba who yang when we're off front enter and when you're at the door uba who yeah oh actually you need a mile in pharmacy and what the same building for information or what's up 401-75-70-300 and a plus 401-69-92-254 pro technologies we have the solutions for your security and home entertainment needs at affordable prices